An Eye for an Eye, A Tale from Thousand and One Arabian Nights Once there lived a prince. He lost one of his eyes. But now he was not a prince, he wandered here and there as a noble man. One day he came to an inn to stay for the night. He hired a room in the inn and stayed there in the night. As he liked the place very much he stayed there for days. The daughter of the inn's owner met him occasionally. She took pity on him and asked how he had lost his eye. The nobleman said, My father was a king. It so happened that, one day when I was away to my cousin's kingdom, one wicked minister cunningly killed my father and came to the throne. And while I was returning back to my kingdom, the minister's men captured me on the way. He ordered his men to take my left eye. This was how I lost my one eye. He said in a low voice. The daughter of the inn asked him, Why did the minister take your eye? He said. The minister wanted to take revenge on me. It is also a separate story. Said that prince. He then continued. In my young age, I was wandering with bow and arrows. When I was shooting, it had hit the minister's left eye unexpectedly. So he lost his left eye and he was awaiting a suitable opportunity to revenge me. So after murdering my father, he captured me, when I returned to my kingdom. I begged for mercy and told him that I did not blind his eye purposefully. But he didn't listen to my words and blinded my left eye and sent me away from the kingdom, to the forest. I was wandering in the forest for many days. One day, the animal hunters took pity on me and brought me here. Since then I have been staying here. He finished. The inn owner's daughter said. Oh, I feel sad for you. The wicked minister should not have done this. You shot his eye unintentionally, and also you were a little boy then. She further added. You can stay here as long as you want. One-eyed person thanked her.